What's good YouTube, Ben here. Welcome to the next video on the channel. Today I'm going to be showing you how to play online on Demon's Souls using RPCS3. So if you want to see more content like this, don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. Don't forget to join me on Twitch. That link is going to be in the description below. Let's jump into the video. Well, you obviously know what RPCS3 is because you're on the video, but if you don't, it's a PS3 emulator that allows you to emulate PS3 games. And certain games have online access, including Demon Souls. I was actually just playing through uh, parts of Demon Souls with my friend Lethal. Um, so I'm going to quickly show you how to just get that set up quickly. It's not a really hard process, but basically what you want to do is you want to go to configuration and go to just click to CPU, go to network, make sure this is connected. Uh, PSN status is set to RPCN, DNS is 8.8.8.8, .8 and you're going to want this as well. This is specifically for Demon Souls to access the network on Demon Souls. I'll put this in the comments, uh, the comments in the description below, so that'll be in the description below. Then once you've done that, uh, of course you want to make sure that that applies. Then you want to go to configuration again and go to RPCN, and... You're going to want the host np.rpcs3.net, just like that. Uh, whatever your username is going to be, like, so mine's Ben Does Variety, because that's my name. Uh, you want to set your password, so just click this, and it'll ask you to set your password. I've already done mine. Uh, and then once you've done that, to get the token, you're going to want to create an account. So all you do is click that, type in your email address, and in your emails, you'll be sent a token that you use to sign in. Now, make sure that you keep this token somewhere where you're going to have it, because if you ever get signed out of this, you're going to need it to sign back in to your account. So keep the token safe. That is priority. I've got mine started in my Gmail, so it's there. I, it won't ever go anywhere now. So once you've done that, just put your token in, click save, and boom, there you go. You're basically set. And once it works... You just boot up the game and then what will happen is it should tell you that you've joined the 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 arch it's arch archstone network that's it so it's just gonna boot the game like it's a very simple very easy process there is a slight chance it wouldn't connect for me at first with this because I had to accept RPCS3 through my firewall uh, you might have to do that, so just go into your firewall settings and just accept it as a program. There are plenty of tutorials out there to tell you how to do it, but I can quickly show you right now, actually. So you want to just go to your control panel, so click start and then go to control panel. And then go to system and security, go to Windows Defender Firewall and allow an app through Windows Firewall. And then change settings, allow another app. And then you browse for the app, which is there, it went by the monitor. Uh, you browse for your app and then just click add, and that adds it into the firewall. I don't need to do it since I've already done it. But you just do that to add it through firewall, it's pretty easy. But once you boot the game, it's going to check for trophies, because you can actually get trophies on this, which is kind of cool. Go through the 50 logos of the game that we unfortunately can't skip, which kind of sucks, but it's fine. You know, this is a, like a 2009 game, so I get it. There are concessions that have to be made. I'm also running in 60 FPS as well because there is a mod for this. Where, well, it's a sort of cheat thing you can use to make it go to 60 FPS. Runs super smooth too. Just remember, like, if the game isn't running that well for you, you might not have powerful enough hardware. So I run a AMD uh, Ryzen 5 3600X 6 core with 12 threads. Um, I've got a, a GTX 1060 Ti. Um, 16 gigabytes of 3000 megahertz uh, Corsair Vengeance RAM. So just remember if it's not running that well for you, then there we go. Logging into Demon Soul servers and boom, welcome to the Archstones RPCS3 online play. So that's basically how you connect it to online and then you just connect with other players like you normally would. Get your blue stone, activate it, make sure you're in human form, otherwise it won't work, and then boom, you can play online with friends or go on invasions once you've got the invasion stone. So I hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe if this did help you. And don't forget to join me on Twitch. That link is in the description below. And I'll see you guys next time.